Hi everyone, my name is Tom Fong. I'm a demonstration teacher at Cajon High School. I'd like to show you how to use a Google Forms quiz as a formative assessment in Google Classroom. Here, I've already made a Google Forms quiz. It's the Chemical Reactions Formative Assessment. I want to make sure that in the Settings tab, under Quizzes, I have it toggled towards Make This a Quiz. Here in this box, I want to make sure that it is not checked to turn on lock mode. If you have this checked, students can only take the quiz on a Chromebook, and some of them may not have a Chromebook at home. I want to click Save. This is my quiz. It's ready to go. I'm going to go to my Google Classroom for MYP Chemistry Period 2. I'm going to click Classwork. Here, I'm going to create an assignment. I'm going to name it Chemical Reactions. Open of assessment. I want to make sure it's for my MYP period two class. I want to make it worth 20 points. I'm going to set the due date as Friday, April 10th. And the topic will be for week one from April 6th to April 10th, chemical reactions enrichment. I'm going to click add and I'm going to click my Google Drive. It'll automatically populate with the last assignments that I've worked on. Here is my chemical reaction formative assessment here. I'm going to click add. When it's added, it's going to add as a quiz and it will require students to input their email as well as restrict users to only those people in our domains. I want to make sure it's toggled towards grade importing because when the quizzes are done, I want to be able to import the grades in the Google Classroom. I'm going to hit Assign. Here's the assignment right here. It'll automatically populate at the top of my Classwork tab. I've already arranged my Classwork by days of the week, and I want this assignment to be done on Friday. So I'm going to take this, and I'm going to move it down to the bottom of the week, so that way I can use this as a formative assessment to check for my students' understanding about chemical reactions. When I go to my stream, the assignment is always going to be posted at the top because the stream posts your last assignment at the very top. However, I want my announcement regarding distance learning with my office hours and my expectations for distance learning at the top. So I'm going to click here and I'm going to click move to the top. And now my expectations are at the top and I want my announcements regarding my office hours to be above that. So I'm going to click here. I'm going to move that to the top. And now my stream is in the order in which I would like it to be with my announcements for my office hours, my expectations, and all the assignments that have been posted. If you need more help on how to set this up, please feel free to contact me.